What's up, guys? God, I hate myself. Uh, I'm just kidding, but that's bad. Uh, check the description for all the information you need. Check playlists on HackerRank and Lead Code Solutions. And this is the Java series on HackerRank and Java. All right, I'm gonna get more positive. Java strings introduction. We're in. We're introing Java strings here. So. Uh, this exercise is to test your understanding of Java strings. A simple string declaration is string my string equals hello world. Great. Elements of a string are called characters. Do you know where characters come from? The alphabet. There's 26. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, F, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? You understand? Um, number of characters in a string is called the length, and it can be retrieved from the string.length method. Wow. Uh, given two strings, this is what we're going to do. We're going to get A and B, A and B strings. Sum the lengths of them. So we just do A dot length plus B dot length, and we're going to print that. Boom, right there. This is an example. Um, and then we're going to do determine if A is lexicographically larger, meaning that if we compare them in a dictionary, A comes, B comes before, A comes after it because it's greater. You know, like two comes after one, two is greater, you know, in value. Uh, capitalize the first letter in A and B and print them on a new single line. So that's pretty much it. Three lines of input. First are A and B. We're going to print the length. We're going to print yes if A is lexicographically greater than B. No, instead, that's just a built-in. And then the third line is freaking, I'm going to complain about that. You just capitalize the first letter of each word and print the words on a single line separated by space. So first we're going to get the lengths. So A length, we can type the whole words, might as well. Uh, a length is this, B length is this, um, B dot length. Um, we're gonna print already, boom, part one done. We get the lengths, because they told us how to get them up there. We're gonna print. Uh, we could have just wrote, written these in the print statement, but whatever, we're gonna waste space and use variables for no reason. Um, we're gonna do print A length plus B length. So there we go, we're printing, that's the first part done. Boom. Now we're gonna use this compare to method, if a dot compare to, because there's a built-in method to check if one, a string is lexicographically greater than another string. So this will check if a is lexicographically greater than b. Um, you can actually store the results in a variable because it's just gonna return an int. Um, look up the compare to method if you wanna understand it. I think we're gonna use it in a future problem, so you can just check that out if you don't understand. But if result is greater than zero after we call this, that means that we're gonna print yes because lexicographically a is greater than b. So we're gonna do system dot out dot print new line yes. Woo! Else we're gonna print no. Right, just like what it says up there. Pretty straightforward, we're already done with step two. Okay, here's the part I'm gonna complain about because what I wanted to do, what I like to do in programming is just be able to easily uppercase the first letter of a string, but in Java, you, strings are immutable, so you can't use the character class, you can't just do character dot two uppercase on the first character. You actually have to do some crud like this. We're just gonna write the print statement and write it within. You have to do a dot substring of zero to one, meaning the first character dot two uppercase. So there you go. You uppercase the first character. Now you have to add the rest of the string a dot substring of one, meaning from one to the end of the string. Um, plus, you know, I just think this is unnecessary, and you can fix that. So Java, fix that. Okay, and then we're gonna do b dot substring of 0 to 1, uh, dot 2 uppercase, like this is too long guys, come on, um, plus b dot substring to the end of the string, right, okay, there we go, let's run this code, let's run it, let's run it, let's run it, oh, uh, we failed all our test cases, what did we do wrong, let's actually run this and see what we did wrong, what did I do wrong? What it, no, oh, it's got to be lowercase o and uh, lowercase es. Sorry about that, guys. Sorry for wasting more of your time. All right, there we go. That was it. That's our introduction to strings. We don't. All we learned is that uh, capitalizing characters are annoying. We can get the length and add them. And then the compare to is a comparator method to check lexicographically which string is greater. That's going to be really useful, and we're going to go over that in the future. So thanks for watching. Check out the next one. I'm doing about 60 more of these. So yeah, thanks for watching. See you guys next time.